roots are showing. Can <laughs> you believe it? It's almost... When did I do this? April? Twenty four months. Wow. It's not red anymore, but... <laughs> well, hello my fellow Martians and welcome back to my channel and in today's video we are going to be talking about Preptember. Oh boy, it's here. <laughs> what is up my fellow Martians? It's your girl, Mama Martian and welcome back to the Martian headquarters. Now this is another Martian chatty vlog. It's been a while since I last did something like this and the reason why I'm doing this is because Preptember is here. Boy, this year just went... <gasps> Everything is just fast forward this year and I can't believe it's already September. <laughs> On one hand, I'm excited because September is my birth month. Another year for me. <laughs> and also, it's September. I mentioned it already. And for me, September means Preptember. And Preptember is that time of the year where I prepare for two events. That will happen after September. <laughs> now, usually I do NaNoWriMo during November. Most authors do NaNoWriMo. <laughs> but I also did something for October. And I believe I started this last year, I believe. And I... Oh boy. <laughs> I still don't know why I'm going to do this. Because the last time I tried it, I regretted it. But I enjoyed it as well. And I'm doing it this year again. Hopefully that it will be different. <laughs> Here's the thing. September, October, November are just busy months for me in terms of writing. Because for September, it's my prep month. Because for October, I am doing Promptober and for Na November, I am doing NaNoWriMo. If you're curious what Promptober is, I basically told myself that for the whole month of October, I will be writing for prompt every single day of the month and that's actually brain torture because after October it's nano but I decided to torture myself even more the whole the whole reason why I started Promptober is because I thought I was running out of story ideas and at the same time I was researching different artists and I came across you know their albums and their songs and I thought hmm why not write a short story or just why not come up with a story with every single song I listen to and that has been what I've been doing most of the time like whenever I listen to a certain song and I love that song a story comes into mind I don't think I'm the only writer who experiences that I mean we all have like listened to a song or watched a movie or a video where we're like that's a cool concept, I will play with that. <laughs> and that's why Promptober was born. Now the reason why I am doing this is first, this is an intro for my Preptember and for my September. And I will discuss what will be happening to me and to this channel from the start of September to the end of September. That's it. <laughs> now, content wise, I will still be putting out vlogs. I will still be doing streams. <laughs> But this is where I debated a lot because since it's Preptember, I want to focus all the content for Preptember only. Which means every single vlog footage that I have on my phone that's like filmed from June, July, August, I, I will have to put a stop to that. I will be uploading them maybe by next year because by December, I don't know what my content will be. I don't know what kind of theme I will be going with for December. If I'm going to go with the Christmas thing or or I'm just going to proceed with other stuff. I don't know. So I'm just going to put a stop to that and focus on September content for September, October content for October, and Nana content for November. But we're going to talk about those other contents for the next month. <laughs> not now, this is September. <laughs> so I also did a small, it's not small, it's big. <laughs> I did a minimalistic kind of a bullet journal for this month. So this is September. This is like all the important details that will be happening, including birthdays and streams and uploads. And yeah, my dailies, my weeklies. And I didn't want to do the last part, but I had to put this one. For a very specific reason. <laughs> so I have three main goals for September and three brownie point additional goals. Like if I achieve these other additional goals, I get to have brownies for it. <laughs> okay, so the main goals for this month is first, choose the prompts for next month. Last year I did this 
so poorly. I chose the prompts like three days before October started and that's just... <laughs> now I want to make sure that I choose the prompts from the very beginning of September. I'm not going to lie, choosing prompts is a hard thing because I have a spreadsheet where I have all these lists of songs and it's not yet done. I'm still adding more and more songs to it and it's hard because I have to randomly choose a song and because there's a lot, it takes a lot of time. And to do that in one day, sometimes it's tiring, but if I can do it in one day again, then no problem. <laughs> Next goal, the second goal is to finish the TAOH handwriting phase. Um, it's originally TSOH, but since I'm splitting it into two books, I am about to finish the first one and it's TAOH and I want to finish the, the handwriting phase for that within this month. Hopefully by the second week or third week of September, it's done. I think I will be done by the second week because I'm almost at the end of this of the first book and I'm very excited for that. And the third goal is to submit another contract for Redic. Redic is another uh, writing site or reading app that I have a contract with and they've been helping me, you know, with you know, with the bills and stuff, and I submit monthly to them. That's the goal. I submit monthly stories to them. And this month, I will be submitting the third season of The Impact of Her. And yeah, that's another thing in itself because I will have to edit that as well and make sure that everything is readable, you know, to be accepted. And for my additional goals, I would love to continue the TIOH typewriter session. It's not going to be that hard because I already started the typewriter session for that what last year or last last year and the only thing that I need to do in a typewriter is what I am currently writing now so I would like for that to be finished within this month hopefully and next is to submit uh, contracts to other writing sites I have a lot of writing sites and I would love to submit more and more contracts because more and more stories uh, yeah, <laughs> writing is our job now. <laughs> and the very last one is to post music related content on TikTok. I, yeah, <laughs> I have been using TikTok, but not for the reasons that you think. <laughs> I've been posting more of my music related content there, which is more on my songwriting and on my dancing. Yes, I'm, I dance. <laughs> I grew up as a dancer uh, because for some reason, uh, schools here always require you to dance during uh, certain events. It's been a long time since I last danced and these days only my son gets to see that. Only my son gets to see that I still dance and I've been enjoying TikTok so much so I've been posting you know a few uh, songwriting content and a few dancing content here and there so yeah. So in regards to scheduling I'm not mad. Okay, so I'm gonna just show you what's gonna happen. So the pink one, the pink ones, this one, this just focus on this. Okay, so the pink ones are related to my YouTube. So this one, these are for the streams and the other ones are videos. I'm debating if I should do like a stream on my birthday. That's why there's a pink and the reason why there's a purple is purple is for Twitch. So I'm debating if I should do that. And next is the orange is for filming purposes, you know, filming for content. Green is for posting online. Because I have the tendency to just post on my social media accounts whenever I need to like promote a new video or a stream and I don't want that. So this is a schedule for me to remind me that, hey, you need to post something today. You don't have any videos or streams, but you need to post something today. This is my birthday. The other threes are important birthdays as well, but I won't get into details whose birthday that is. <laughs> and as for my weekends, as you can see, the weekends are blank. It's because on Sundays, it's a given. I don't want to work on Sundays. Sundays are my rest days and it's time for me to just sit back and focus on my spirit on the spiritual aspect of my life and with Saturdays it really depends on what I do it really depends so my son scared me so yeah that is the plan and yeah so that's my daily for the first week of September which is actually now uh... so yeah that's basically what's gonna happen for September we're going to focus on September content I want to upload like 
book related content but like I said it's September I don't think I will be able to read as much same goes with October and November with December who knows we will have to see what will happen with December but that's all I have for you today folks thank you so much for watching and if you enjoyed this video do give it a big thumbs up and let your thoughts be heard in the comment section below what will you be doing for September will you be doing for September as well or do you have other plans for September let me know in the comments Follow my trail on social media, everything is listed down below, so check me out. I'm also on Patreon, and if you're not on Patreon, if you just like to support the channel and my caffeine addiction, my PayPal is in the description as well. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit that cute bell on the side to notify each time I post a video. I do streams on YouTube and on Twitch as well, which are in the description as well. Again, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys on my next video. Stay safe. Stay creative and happy writing my Martians. I'm ready. Okay, okay, wait a second. Wait a second.